hated. Hey Claire, how's it going? Wanted to change after work. What's going on? You wanted to tell everybody something. Could I get everybody in the living room, please? Thank you all for coming today. We're all here now except for a few family members that couldn't make it. Grandpa and I want to tell you grandkids something. Your parents already know it, but we thought it'd be best to get everybody together as a group. Lately, Grandpa's been having some memory issues. Nothing major, but we thought it'd be best if he went and saw his doctor. After multiple visits, his diagnosis came back as early onset Alzheimer's. There's a brook or a castle, you call it okay. one, okay? That's a knight, that's a bishop, that's a girl. And that's the king. Yeah. And what was that again? Bishop. Yeah. Nine. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> there you go. And these are called. so far no matter where you find yourself you're always where you are go anywhere you go do anything you do I'll be with you take a moment take an hour take another year start again or keep going I'll always be right here feel anything you feel Hear anything you hear, you'll never disappear. So what do you guys think? Six more weeks of winter? <laughs> well, you know it is Iowa. If you don't like the weather, just wait five minutes. Yep, you're right. Remember last year? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. yeah. Hey, anybody ready for dessert? Mm -hmm. Me. Sure. Okay. I know I'm getting worse day by day. I can feel it. I want you to have something while I still remember who you are, okay? We don't have to do this right now. 
We still have time. There's never enough time, honey. I love you so much, more than you'll ever know. You remind me of my sister Rosie, who died when she was younger. You look like her. <laughs> you even have her personality. I know you didn't have a dad growing up, and I'm sorry for that. I am, however, glad that I got to be the one to show you the ropes when it comes to such things as baseball or mowing the grass. I'd like to say I'll never forget these things, but you'll remember for both of us, right? Take this envelope. But don't open it until I can't remember who you are, okay? And I want you to have this. You're not a big fan of God. Your mother told me. But this was Rosie's necklace. I want you to have it. How can you believe in God after he did this to you? You're the most religious person on the planet, and he's putting you through hell. <laughs> we just have to believe that this is part of his plan. That there's a reason, even if we don't even know what that reason is yet. He's getting worse. He's having accidents. And the other night, he tried to walk out of the house. Should we think about putting him in a home? I mean, what if he runs out in the middle of the night and gets hit by a car? He's just gonna get worse. I mentioned that to her. And she said no nursing homes. She did say she was gonna put alarms on the doors. Yeah, and when she doesn't hear them, what happens then? Yeah. What if we take turns spending the night? I live in town, so obviously it's easier for me. Maybe I could get Claire to help out? Of course. I'm in. I can do the first of every month. Okay, well, let's figure it out. Thank you. 
he would be embarrassed having his granddaughter. Thanksgiving. How are you? I'm good. I brought some leftover food from the restaurant, so you guys don't have to cook. Thank you. Hey. Hey, Rosie. When did you get taller? Claire, if you're reading this, I'm so sorry. I never wanted to forget you, and trust me when I say I tried my best. Helping raise you is one of the things I'm most proud of. Remember the first time you hit the ball when I pitched it to you? <laughs> I knew then that you were going to be a star. You always have to remember to choke up on that bat. When you were in middle school, I taught you how to mow the yard. You weren't too thrilled about that. Whether it was the chore itself or hanging out with me at that age, I don't know. I just wish I could have known at the time that it would be the last thing I teach you. Your mother taught you how to drive, and the rest I guess you learned on your own because you're sharp as a tack. I'm not really sure how to end this letter, mostly because it's a letter I never wanted to write. Just remember. I love you so much, and I'll always be with you. And even if you don't believe in God right now, he's still waiting for you. Enjoy every day as if it's your last. I love you, Claire. You're magical. I wonder, are you happy? Do you hear me? Is the spirit that was there, now is it gone? Is it wrong to say I wish I could be with you? Is it selfish to say I feel alone? Are memories of us still within your keeping? Or is all we share now vacant and all gone? 
Do they sometimes come and go, or are they scattered? Like the long forgotten pieces of a song. How often I have wished for just one hour to talk about the memories that are ours. See the recognition in your eyes before they disappear beyond the stars. Whether you are here or bathed in shadows, whether time is kind or life is just, whether you remember or forgotten, I'll hold those memories for both of us.